everybody. My name is Abdurrahman Miligi, and I work as the head of data with uh, Transport for Cairo, TFC, a private consultancy that focuses on uh, enhancing people's access to mobility in Egypt and other African cities uh, as well. Um, I think what I would contribute to mobility data is uh, um, enhancing the, uh, uh, the standards, uh, in particular GTFS, to be able to understand and fully capture uh, popular transport modes or what was called paratransit modes um, in the global south uh, in general. I would combine this understanding of popular transport uh, modes of operation and uh, geographic information systems uh, expertise and the uh, experience working with GTFS to be able to model these uh, services more accurately and therefore uh, having more accurate results for decision makers and uh, policy making uh, in, in global south uh, countries. Dear General Assembly members, my name is Audrey Taifer, currently located in Montreal, Canada, and my favorite way to benefit from the mission of mobility data is the ability to navigate in any big city when I can't rely on my own sense of direction. The contribution I am offering is my solid background in leading the strategy of an international organization with a global harmonization mandate in a different industry. Through my work in developing the next strategic plan of the World Anti-Doping Agency, I can appreciate the complex challenges that come with global harmonization, such as navigating the diverse legal landscape or the cultural disparities in adopting standardized approach. My prior board experience also equipped me with a nuanced understanding of what effective governance mean. Thanks for your consideration. I'm Emmanuel Bama, co-founder of uh, Data Transport. Data Transport is an NGO based in Côte d'Ivoire, West Africa, that work to improve African mobility through data and technology. I would like to join Mobility Data uh, Board of Directors for three main reasons. The first one is that I'm passionate about transport data and I'm currently working on the same topic as mobility data. The second one is that I aim to contribute to expand uh, the impact of mobility data in Africa, especially in West Africa. The third one is that I like to bridge the gap between mobility data solution, data standards, data specification, and the local context of Africa. Thank you. What an honor it is to be selected as a candidate for the board member position for mobility data. I'm Gemma Schepes and I'm working for a lot of years for the city of Amsterdam. I have gained a lot of experience working in the micromobility field um, on data, data exchange and data standards. Therefore, I really understand how not only the Netherlands, but also Europe is working and the whole mobility ecosystem. I want to bring in my network in Europe to really further mature the mobility ecosystem because we're in a stage that we really need to grow and mature in this ecosystem. In Europe, we're using a lot of data standards that are built in America and I think we can really build a bridge between the vision of the United States, the speed that you have and also the institutional governance structure that we have in Europe. So therefore I really want to um, expand the knowledge and build a bridge. People are not traveling only within our country but we travel all over the world so I think it's really important to really have the global vision to mature this ecosystem. Hello, my name is George Gonzalez. I'm 34, passionate about passenger transport, and I'm currently working as Intelligent Transport System Standards Manager at the French Ministry of Ecological Transition. Part of my mission is to work with European partners in Data for PT project to deploy transmodel derived standards. I want to contribute with my understanding of European standards to Mobility Data Board of Directors. I hope we can give the community a clearer picture of what each standard is made for. Having worked a lot with GTFS in the past, I have a pretty good understanding of it. Another part of my mission is to implement the French National Access Point to transport data. 
I can contribute with our experience on collecting, converting, and validating datasets from the whole country to help the community to replicate our success in getting data published and reused. At the European level, I do the same through Network Project. Thank you very much. Hi, I'm Josie Sabouret. Prior to my current role at Urban Sharing, I had the privilege of working at Mobility Data for three and a half years, working on our GPFS efforts. During that time, I developed a passion for the shared mobility industry, as well as open data standards more generally. I'm eager to bring that passion and those expertise to our boardroom, where I see a gap in industry standards, industry knowledge, when it comes to shared mobility. As a recognized leader in the industry, I see myself as a versatile asset, a resource, a sounding board, and a cheerleader for our team and for our members. Whether that's answering GBFS queries, providing insights on community building, or just lending an ear to brainstorm more generally, you can count on me. I'm ready to bring a fresh perspective to our board and a positive energy into our mission. Thank you for considering me and together, let's continue transforming transportation, pushing boundaries and improving our communities through data. Thank you. Cheers to the journey ahead. Hi, I'm Logan Nash. I'm Director of Transit Technology at the MBTA in Boston. And like so many transit agencies across the world, we benefit enormously from GTFS and related mobility data specifications. And it's been amazing to be a part of the growth of those specifications in recent years, from real-time crowding data in the pandemic, to next generation fares, to current work on trip modifications and detours. But none of that work would be possible if it wasn't for having a healthy mobility data organization, which is why I'm proud as a member of the board for the past three years that we've been able to hire Eric as a visionary executive director, to improve and make more transparent our spec adoption process, and most of all, to help the organization embrace the transit operational data standard and other tools which will help transit agencies and data producers unearth and unlock that core operational data which we will need if we plan to provide travelers with the next generation of detailed, useful data. So if elected to another three-year term, I want to continue that focus on organizational health, evolving our specs, and supporting transit agencies and producers. Thank you. Hello, my name is Masaki Ito. I'm excited about the possibility of joining the Board of Directors at Mobility Data. I'm an Associate Professor at the University of Tokyo. For 10 years, I've been working to promote GTFS Open Data in Japan. In Japan, the efforts of grassroots communities are key to creating GTFS data. We now have over 600 GTFS datasets available, mainly for buses. These efforts involve people from transportation companies, application developers, local governments, and the citizen developers. I'm leading these grassroots activities, but we face challenges. Many government bodies and large organizations have not yet fully embraced standardization. This is where mobility data can play a bigger role in Japan. I hope to bring our community's success to the global stage with mobility data. I believe our experiences in Japan can help improve public transport worldwide. Denomination Committee. Uh, my name is Stefan Koritar and um, I would like to thank you for being selected and presented with uh, this opportunity to pitch myself in front of you and present myself in a, let's say, very short, for, short period of time. But um, I would like to be mindful of your time and going through all of these videos. So I would like to jump straight into it because I know you can have a look over my LinkedIn profile, my experiences and so on, and we can always go into details about that. But um, what I would like to say is that um, I've given it some thought about how can I contrib contribute to, to mobility data and um, looking into my past experiences at Telenav and Balaz and so on and working with open source data. Um, I came up to three points that would be, I think, interesting um, for me personally, uh, foremost, um, and then um, being able to, to contribute out of that to mobility data. So um, those three points are basically, I've made a note um, over here, those three points would be be a voice, uh, be an advocate for uh, mobility data standards, because I know that in this current world, in this setup, um, interoperability um, is kind of doomed to failure if you do not have those data standards and that um, communication based on those data standards between different ecosystem players and stakeholders. So that would be number one. 
um, that it's something that I can um, stand on and be uh, for mobility data. Um, how does that translate into specific actions? I would leave that to how to a possible conversation in the future between us of how that looks like. The second one is, for example, um, if I am presented with any kind of opportunity where I could be in a position that I can pitch uh, our membership benefits, um, I will do so um, for the greater mission, for the greater objective of mobility data um, uh, mission. Um, I will do so and explain um, as I will um, best can <laughs> at a specific moment in time uh, what we do and how can uh, mobility data as an organization and what uh, you do, possibly we do in the future, how can that organization um, uh, reap those benefits. And the third one would be serve the organization's needs uh, with my skills and experience so far. And I think this kind of says it um, all in terms of um, how, uh, how I can be of help. Um, from everything that I've done so far, um, I'm more than willing to contribute that to the, um, the overall objective and mission of the, of the organization. I've taken a lot of your time so far, so thank you very much for um, reviewing my application. And um, I'm all years, and uh, if, you, if, you, if you have uh, any other questions um, to me, but... Um, yeah, thank you very much for your time um, and good luck with the, the selection process. Bye. Hello, I'm Taylor Reich. I use they, them, gender neutral pronouns. I'm the data science manager at ITDP. And I am so excited about this opportunity to apply for the Mobility Data Board of Directors. I've been working in my role at ITDP. I've been working with mobility data for a while now. For example, I organized the panel on Global South Perspectives at the summit two years ago. I've helped connect organizations with mobility data to provide comment on FAIRS v2 and other uh, technical issues. And now I'm ready to take my involvement to the next level. So I have two goals in mind for service on the mobility data board. Uh, first, I'd like to help promote GTFS use in lower and middle income countries, especially with my existing network, but also finding new opportunities to really help grow our community and grow our impact, bring more people into the mobility data community. Second, I'd like to support mobility data in showing our impact to philanthropic funders, especially climate funders. Um, I do this a lot at ITDP, show the climate impacts of transforming transportation, and I really do think that GTFS and GBFS have already had a huge impact in helping to get people out of their cars and into more sustainable modes, and I think that this can help us diversify our funding stream and get more resources for the important work that Mobility Data is doing. Anyway, I know I've gone a little over, little over a minute, so thank you so much for your time, and I'm just excited to keep working with Mobility Data in whatever way seems best. Thank you.